Hey, what's going on guys? It's Cassie here today, back with another video, and uh, oh my god, you guys are fucking crazy at the moment. Um, if you don't know what's what's happening, I just reached, last night I just reached like one over 1,000 subscribers. That's, that, I don't know what to say, that's just fucking crazy that I managed to, you guys managed to help me like reach that goal. Like, at the turn of the year, of the new year, I managed to reach my goal of obtaining 1,000 subscribers. And honestly, guys, um, thank you so much for helping me reach that goal. <laughs> like, at the beginning of the year, I didn't even have 100 subs. I didn't even have 50 subs. You know what I mean? Like, I barely had an audience to begin with. Back then I was making like ASMR content that barely got like, I'd say like a hundred views. Yeah, there was a few good ones here and there that got like, you know, several hundred views. And back then I was like, wow, that's incredible. I can actually do this. And I, that's, that's something that's never happened to me before. Um, but now I'm gaining views in like the tens of thousands. My latest video detailing Minecraft controversies, um, Oh my god, it has like pretty much nearly 50k views at the time of recording, and it's probably going to get up to 50k, um, in a, probably in a few hours, so I'm sorry my Discord went up. Um, but yeah, I honestly didn't think I can do it, because back then, like over the course of like a, several years, I've been wanting to be a content creator, I've been wanting to make videos so that way people can enjoy and watch it. You know, and yeah, there's going to be some people that, you know, might have something to say about my videos. But that's fine. You know, I can, I'll have all the criticism I need. You know what I mean? But the last few YouTube channels I've had for like over the course of like a few years, they never did as good as mine is currently going right now. Like it took me like several years to actually figure out how to, you know, how to it took me this it took me this long just to figure out how to actually grow an audience probably because back then i was I, I wanted to become a gaming youtuber so just like markiplier i wanted to be like a you know the next big gaming youtuber and so um i never really got much of an audience even though i thought i was going to get like you know thousands and thousands of views but it never really turned out of much of anything I, those videos back then me playing horror games <laughs> indie horror games uh, those barely got like 50 views and I barely managed to reach 100 subs before I quit and then a few years later I started this channel and I started posting Minecraft content and then from there I started to figure out hmm maybe I should tap into other markets see what see what actually you know is favorable towards me and slowly but surely I've started to figure things out and lo and behold Commentaries about, you know, stupid internet drama and uh, crazy stuff that people um, have done online. It's just, man, it's like, hey, that actually worked for me. I struck a gold mine pretty much. And I want to keep, you know, this momentum going at this point. So honestly, guys, like, thank you so much. I, I, I really appreciate it, honestly, with all the support. I never really thought I'd get this far. I honestly, I mean, I had a feeling I was going to reach 1,000 subs, but I thought it was not going to be until like sometime in the middle of next year. You know what I mean? And, but now it's like, wow, I managed to reach 1,000, over 1,000 subs. At the time of recording, it's like over 1,400 subs in the matter of like 24 hours ever since um, the the Minecraft video came up. And honestly, like, I never thought you guys would like that video so much. I mean, I mean, look at other people. Um, I mean, I've seen other YouTubers that do way better than me, but obviously they had several more, ex several more years of experience than I currently have at the moment. And to be honest, like, I never, I never really like did it to get famous, honestly. I mean, yeah, gaining an audience is great and all, but I, ne I only did it just to, you know, gain, not gain, but I only did it so that way I can express my creativity and make content because I thought it was interesting. 
I get to have my voice put out there, you know, in a good in a good light, you know, and I can leave a digital footprint so that way I'm not completely forgotten about, you know, I'm not just some nobody, you know. I mean, you don't have to be a, you can be, you don't have to be a YouTuber, you can still be somebody, you know. Being a YouTuber is not the end goal here for everybody on Earth. That's not the case at all, you know. You can be somebody when you're a lawyer or a doctor or, you know, a physicist or a top researcher at a university, but um, for me, I just wanted to make content and having to see all the support, it's like, wow, I never really thought I'd get this far. It's crazy, like I can actually turn this into a business instead of a hobby. I mean, it's still a hobby for me, but it's always gonna be a hobby for me, but to actually have the chance at turning this into a full-time job, thanks to YouTube's partner program, it's incredible. Like I can, I have the chance now to no longer work in fast food, because at the moment of recording, I'm still working at fast food. Hell, I just got off of work like an hour ago. So I'm here at home, sitting by myself, in the middle of New Year's Eve, recording um, how potentially I could make this a job. And to be honest, that's fucking incredible. Excuse my, excuse my French here, but, oh, sorry. Fireworks going on in the background. I might have to cut some of this shit out, but um, yeah, I mean, if I can like make this a business, thanks to you guys, um, that would mean the entire world for me. And I have like so many ideas to put out there at the moment. Like I, I was thinking of some really cool shit I wanted, I want to share with you guys real soon. You know, some of it includes collabing with other YouTubers. Some of them are some YouTubers that are even like miles ahead of me when it comes to like you know channel growth and subs <laughs> like i got so much shit planned uh for this coming year it's gonna be insane it's gonna be wild and hopefully you guys um uh, are in it for the ride because man i'm not done yet <laughs> but yeah um honestly that that's all i all i can say is just thank you so much for fireworks Thank you so much for, you know, having me go into, into the big YouTuber category, sort of having over 1,000 subs. I mean, it's not particularly huge by today's standards, but it is certainly of some size, you know. I'm not just some kid who's just trying to make a, who's, who's just trying to make videos anymore. I mean, I'm kind of like that, but I'm now actually like an actual YouTuber who's gained the trust of a lot of people. That's why you guys sub to me, because you guys want to see some good content. Otherwise, I wouldn't have a thousand subs. So, yeah. Thank you guys so much for over 1k. It really means a lot to me. I was going to make like a 300k, not 300k, uh, 300 sub special yesterday. I already recorded it, but you guys went hog wild on, on my subscribe button. And now I'm just recording the 1000 sub button on New Year's Eve. So... Thank you guys so much. It really means the world to me. And uh, yeah, onwards to 10,000 subs. Or 100k, <laughs> if we can make it that far. But yeah, guys, um, I'll see you guys later. Sleep tight. Good night. And bye-bye.